Hi, I'm Kurt Schmucker. I'm an evangelist in the Mac team at Microsoft. This release of Office for Mac includes support for new styles of collaboration. For example, co-authoring is the ability for multiple authors to all be editing in a document at the same time, whether that's a Word document, a PowerPoint presentation, or an Excel spreadsheet. It used to be the case you had to mail around a document among multiple authors. Who has the latest copy? Is this the last one? The final? The final, final, final? And this happened all the time. Those sort of problems become a thing of the past in this new scenario. Co-authoring is now possible because of the widespread nature of cloud storage that Microsoft makes available to both consumers in SkyDrive and businesses in SharePoint. A document is now stored in a location that multiple authors can access. In addition, we also have support for the Office web apps. That lets a user edit an Office document even if they're on a machine that doesn't have Office installed on it. When it comes to working together, Office 2011 not only helps you collaborate, it helps you coordinate. My name is Amy Wang. I'm a developer at Microsoft. My name is Ryan Panchatzer, and I'm a program manager. Both Amy and I work on Outlook for Mac. For Office for Mac 2011, we added a feature called Scheduling Assistant. We found people would switch between mail and calendar so often that it started to break their workflow. So we introduced inline calendaring in mail. So when you get a meeting invite, you can actually see if it conflicts with any meetings on your calendar, and you can accept or decline it from your mailbox. It's now easier to find times that there are no conflicts and even to book a room. With our improvements in calendaring, we've made working together better. With the flexibility in the calendaring view, you're able to see your entire week. If you want, you can even look at just the work week or a particular day. If you want to make things a little bit easier, you can sift out particular categories to find out times that work for your team. Because the experience is more dynamic, richer, and beautiful, it's become more Mac-like, and we think you're going to enjoy using it. The thing is, calendaring is just one of the ways that Office from Mac 2011 helps people work better together. My name's Eric, and I'm a program manager for Office for Mac. When it comes to working better together, one feature I think people are going to be really excited about is Broadcast Slideshow. Broadcast Slideshow lets you share your PowerPoint presentation real time with anyone in the world as long as they have an internet connection. They don't even need to have PowerPoint. Because you don't have to email the file, you don't have to worry about file size as much, you don't have to worry about compatibility as much, and you can be confident that anybody who gets your presentation is going to be able to watch it. What I used to have to do is take my presentation beforehand, email it out to everybody who's going to watch it, and then tell them over the phone next slide, next slide, next slide. And now all I have to do is open up PowerPoint, click Broadcast Slideshow, send them a link, and they can watch it live as I'm presenting. That's super helpful for anybody that works on a team where not everybody's at the same location. So aside from wanting happy customers, what really drives me to make awesome features for Office for Mac is that I use it every day. So I want it to be as easy to use and as fun to use as possible.